Welcome to another honest review by Muscle Cow. I don't know what time it is for you, morning, night, evening, but whatever time of day it is, I hope you're having a good one. Let's get in and check this out. I'm late today because I was out with uh, my lady and family going for dinner for a late birthday dinner. Um, so let's see. High Tide. Oh, look at that wrap. All right. Interesting. Interesting. Let's see. That looks nice. But it's an epic. Looks really nice. Um, I'm a little disappointed it's not a full wrap. Though. To be honest, because most of the epic wraps cover the weapons entirely. Uh, this one looks like it's not covering... The wrap's not going over the barrel. Um, so the animation won't be all the way through the, the weapon. It does look pretty cool though. It does look like water. That That's for sure. Um, but it, it kind of looks... You know, I think it kind of looks like the slurp animation. Just... Uh, I think it looks better than the slurp animation. But it's not over the entire weapon so but tidal wave you are mine now excellent get in my locker my locker yeah yeah you can see here the front of the vehicle is not covered by the wrap um where if we look at like like slurp you can see there the whole thing and magma the whole things are covered by the wrap so it gives a lot better effect on the animation you can see a lot more of it it's a lot more in your face it looks really nice like this slurp animation this wrap has grown on me since i reviewed it i do like it um but if we look at tidal wave i think the animation the actual animation of the tidal wave is better quality on this wrap but it's lack lacking because it is not over the entire vehicle um, if it was covering the whole vehicle here at the front like slurp does i think it would probably look a lot cooler it would look a lot a lot 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 better um so that kind of sucks to be honest um but yeah let's uh let's go check it out and see how it looks in game on all the weapons and all the vehicles I like, I just gotta say, I like the beach bomber skin a lot. It's super, super nice. And these pickaxes are really wicked too. I just, I hadn't done all my challenges, so I just got them, but they're really nice. I, I kind of want to see how it looks in the uh, light versus in the dark. So this is in the light, and if I just pull back, in the dark. It looks pretty much the same. Um, looks, I guess, a little better in i don't know looks about the same actually to be honest with you doesn't really change much all right looks nice on that looks nice on this revolver that looks pretty wicked Ooh, it looks nice on that actually it's kind of kind of like got a glow to it right now i kind of see a glow see here i wish it covered the sniper barrel because you can't really see the animation at all on that, so that sucks. We already saw that guy. Yeah, you can really see the waves on that there. Now this one is kind of cool. It looks like the waves are like crashing down on the... Uh... Oh, it looks like it changed. It's not as far down the weapon now. Oh, look at that. Oh, wow. Okay, so the wave actually... It goes up the gun... And then it comes all the way down the gun. Would you look at that? That's kind of cool. Okay, I like this wrap a little bit more now. So that is a totally different animation. That is something actually that we haven't seen before. That's really cool. So now, Tidal Wave makes sense. It goes all the way up. And then it comes all the way down. Sorry, I'm holding this for a while, but... You can see it really good on this shot, on the tactical. That looks really cool. You can't notice that on the pistols as much. Pump. Wonder, oh, you probably noticed it on the combat. Combat's long. Let's see here. Curious. 
Uh, yeah, you can see it just go all the way up there. It's all the way up at the top. Then it comes all the way down. There it comes. Down the barrel. Okay, it stops just past the shell on this one. So you can actually see it better on the tactical. How about this guy? Oh, wow. Yeah, this one looks wicked. The whole gun gets covered up with water on this one. Look at that. Oh, my. Look at that. Now it's all sand. All sand. And then it comes down. And it's all water. That's pretty cool. All right. All right, Rap. You've actually kind of saved yourself. I didn't know that that's how it looked. That's actually pretty sick. Oh man, that looks so good on the P90 too. Look at the whole thing's water. And then there it goes. Now it's all sand. That's actually really cool. Because the... Oh yeah, here we go. I'm holding on to a water gun right now. <laughs> oh, it's stupid. Man, it's, go away. Go away. Hub thing. That's actually really cool. Yeah, you can see it huge on this. The whole gun is water. Look at that. The whole thing is blue. Not much sand comes on this one, though, because this one, this gun's weird with wraps. Whatever animation is on the wrap is, like, way exaggerated on the scope. They are. Look at it. It's so sandy. And then all the way down. Dude, that's so cool. And I'm wondering it would I wonder if it would look even better if it was the entire wrap like I was saying before. Now that I know Oh wait, did I check out this one? I don't remember. I feel like I didn't check this out. Look at that! Oh my god, it looks so good on the infantry. Going all the way down the snipes. Pretty cool. Suppressed barrel, though. You don't see much of it on these snipers because the barrel is where most of the animation would be. Oh, actually, never mind. I'm a liar. Look at this. It's coming all the way down this gun. Looks cool. Mini gun. Look at that. All the way up and down. Really cool. Yeah, that's super cool. Well, I am pleasantly surprised. Hoverboard. Now, I don't know. Okay, yeah, it's actually. There we go. Let's see. That's pretty cool. It's a little hard to notice on this. Except when you're here. I can see it right there. Alright, I gotta save the golf cart. Can't do the golf cart yet. Baller. Let's see it on the whole seat there. Oh, look at all that water. She's sitting in water. The whole seat's water right now. That's pretty cool. <laughs> Alright, let me let me give this a second look in game now. Alright. Oh, and there it goes. All the way down. And then Okay. Golf cart. Oh man, look at that on the top of that. That looks so good. 
Almost looks like a sky. Like a blue sky. Pretty cool. Looks pretty cool in the painting plane too. Ooh, it like blend if you fly over the water, this looks like you're blending right into the water. <laughs> so I was actually caught off guard. When I went in game, I wasn't really paying attention, and then when I got in the shotguns, I actually noticed and you can see it here, if you watch it here. You can the actual animation is a wave that actually does go all the way up the barrel and then come all the way down and on some guns it covers almost the entire gun with water and then it goes away so it's like a sandy beach which is actually pretty cool and the animation is actually very well done quality wise when you look at it closely um, when I first saw it I was a little underwhelmed um, and I was a little disappointed that it was an epic and it did not cover the entire uh, weapon like the slurp and the magma do so the front barrel like on the other wraps would be part of the animation. So especially on guns like this, uh, that whole black part of the barrel there would, if it was like Slurp and Magma, that whole part would be water and it would complete the look of the tidal wave going up and down the gun. So I think that's a missed opportunity. Um, it looks great on some stuff, but like this as well, that whole ugly block there of blue, it's kind of blocking out where I would like to see more water on the gun, you know what I mean, to finish the animation and on vehicles. That whole front piece there on Magma or Slurp, if this was styled the same way, that would all be water at the front and it would go all the way down the vehicle. It would look so much better, I think. I don't know if it's because they were trying to frame it out with the blue, like they have the blue accents on it, so I think they were trying to frame it a little bit with that blue on some stuff, but I think they could have designed it a little bit better um in that sense or adjust the cost to be a rare so i'm gonna give it i think okay so i think the design is actually good but i'm not gonna give it cost rarity because i feel like this there's some other rare wraps that are about on the same level as this one like um hex hex wave is really is there uh, enigma um emblem there's a few that are really good that are rare that could match with this but this animation is super original. The details are great. Effects look awesome. I think it's going to be pretty versatile because it's got blue, white, and kind of a, a bit tan in color in it. It looks great on everything. Gameplay visual is very pleasing. How the, the wave goes down the whole weapon or, or whichever. And I mean, if you like this kind of thing, I think it's a good buy. I'm just not, I don't think it's, I think the cost rarity is a little bit off. Um, whether it should have been a rare or they should have adjusted the animation to cover the whole wrap and, and be a bit more of a complete look with the water tidal wave since it is a tidal wave going down the whole weapon or down the whole vehicle i feel like the fact that it's broken up on some of the things that we see a lot of like sniper rifles um like quad crashers um like some of the ars like this one you got the barrel at the front that's not part of it i think it would have been more complete if it covered the whole thing so that's my only gripe. It is a really great wrap. I would have given a lower rating until I realized that the water actually goes all the way down and all the way up the weapon, kind of like on the beach, uh, like the water coming in and out, which is super cool. But yeah, I'm going to give this a 9 out of 10. It's a cool wrap, a little pricey, um, but yeah. And that's it for today, guys. This video was late because I was uh, out doing stuff for late birthday dinner. Um, but I mean, I don't think a lot of people were waiting on this anyways. This is kind of a surprise to me because I don't look at leaks anyways. So I didn't even know this was coming. Um, but yeah, if you guys could take three seconds to drop a like, subscribe, turn on notifications if you want to. I'd greatly appreciate it. Um, I really do appreciate all you initial supporters watching my videos, dropping the odd comment here and there. Um, if you guys want to help promote me, tell me, tell your friends about me. I try to do full, complete, honest reviews. I don't want to be biased with anything. I pay everything with my own money. Um, so, you know, uh, I'm doing this for 
just for the enjoyment and for uh, for you guys to help you guys out with your smart purchases because no one wants to waste money on digital items. <coughs> oh, Tim, you should really tell yourself that. <laughs> Anyhow, guys, thank you. I appreciate you, and I will see you next time. See ya.